Hello, chumps and chumpettes, or... I guess I'm the chump after what happened last time, but... <laughs> uh, back at Garnolio's quest here, anyway. Um, last time I got... The thing from the king. I guess I didn't talk to any of the people in this town. I just went straight to the save house. So... Let's see what these zombos have to say. Baimon has the Candle of Darkness. He lives in the southeast part of the land. He got away. It's not my fault. Majorita can't help you. You need the Candle of Darkness if you want to see Majorita. Do I want to see Majorita? I don't know who that is, or what that is. But, oh, another town already. Huh. You are as red as fire. Stunning observation, my man. Someone stole the candle of darkness. Uh-oh, I needed that. With the powers of claw, you can easily climb even the sheerest wall. We ghouls can be revived by chanting the, yeah, resurrection spell. Oh, right, this is the save house. Well, you know what? I'm in Rome. Or, it's, it's the password house, but I'm making it the save house because I ain't putting up with passwords. You are Firebrand, aren't you? You look like a hero. Try your skill against me. Alright. You going down, brother? Whoa. Ow. Oh, I'm going down. Ah! Well, I got kind of stuck there. <laughs> you consumed one essence. Oh, he's not saying this. This is telling me I died. Majorita lives in the cave of darkness, but there is no way to get there. That's the edge of town. I guess I gotta beat this guy. This little chump. All right, now I know what you do. Easy peasy. Come on, give it up, give it up. You are truly worthy. I bestow the armor of guile upon you. Oh, can I sonic boom now? Your vitality level has increased. Yeah! That's what I was looking for. Whoa, you're very strong. See you later. Oh, only four? I was hoping for five. But I understand why it would only go up by one. Ooh, three vials. How many of those do I have? 44. And I could afford some extra lives. I'm the Baron of the land. I'm on Firebrand, you are too late. They took the candle. It's in the desert of destitution to the east of here. You are chicken hearted. You obviously have no use for power. Your powers and your life are mine. Sure, you are chicken. Huh? Call me a chicken. I'm some kind of demon. You are brave. If you can recover the candle, I'll tell you where Margarita is. Uh, one of your little underlings already told me where Margarita is. Alright. 
I guess there's some kind of trick to this. Oh, check out my wing bar. It is epic now. And I'm not the kind of person who uses that term lightly. Now. <laughs> uh. Oh no, he's got a buddy. Whatever, I won. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Get some vials for my trouble. Noise. Hmm. Some spooky looking dunes in the background. There's no sandy gas. Oh no, this is a bad place to be. Yikes. Almost got a spike up the arse. Oh god. Yeah, I gotta take these uh, little rest stops along the wall a little more seriously, I think. Alright, I think the worst is over. Now I just have to deal with the bonefish. Oh, what's down here? Goodies? Yeah. Hey, goody. Hup. <laughs> hey, I deleted you already. I want this vial. This is the wrong way. Hold on. Ooh, this is bad. <laughs> oh. Ah! How many hits do you take, you stupid plant thing? Can destroy these. Oh, I didn't know that. Last time I saw them, they were just the blocks I couldn't climb on. Uh oh. Uh. Oh, that was tricky. Oh no. The ghost of Primeape is after me. Oh, God, another one. I guess I would make it Annihilate. <laughs> uh, last time I played this game, Annihilate did not exist. Now it does. We live in a better, better future for it. Uh, a much worse future for other reasons. But at least we have Annihilate. And honestly, most of the giant Gen 9 Pokemon. I think it's a pretty strong generation. I know many. Well, at least some people disagree. But... 
think it's pretty great. Oh my god, die, you stupid thing. Get out of here, ghost. Oh, this looks like a boss room if I've ever seen one. Whoa! Check out this guy. Like Lord of the Snails. Ah! He doesn't stop as much as I expect him to. Uh, no. Man, remember when video games were, like... I don't know, not super easy? I know you're like, Ooh, Ryan, but Elden Ring exists. It's like, okay, but that's the exception, not the rule. And then some people are like, Oh, but Elder Drink is easy. You just gotta have the right build. And I'd be like, No, man, I had the, like one of the cheapest builds I could figure out. And it still was not easy. And then those people are like, Oh, fake gamer. And I'm like, Yeah, dude. I did not ever... Well, almost ever use the word gamer to refer to myself. Really do not like that word. Conjures a unfortunate image that I don't really want to be associated with. Even though I really like video games. But I like to think of them more as a hobby than a lifestyle, you know? My appreciation for the medium isn't my whole personality. Although some people will tell you it is. Those people are dumb. Damn it. Stop being so fast. You look like a snail, dude. Why does he sometimes stop, but other times not? It's confusing. Just be dead. Just give it up, man. I wouldn't say that was hard, but it certainly had more health than I expected. Hey! Not cool. You recovered the candle of darkness from the desert of destitution. You also received the power of claw. Cool. What does that do? What does that mean? Am I stronger? Ah, oh, yes, I got a new shot. Nice. Still only two bullets on screen at a time, but that is understandable, given the 
technology. Game Boy, not a lot of uh, moving sprites allowed at once, you know? Thirty-two? Are you kidding, dude? Jacked up the price. Used to be eight. Uh-huh. You have done very well, Firebrand. You can get to the cave where Majorita lives by using the secret passage from this room. Oh, walk through walls. ID no clip. Nice. Yeah, call me a fake gamer now. I say so confidently, even though I'm like, uh, did I get that code wrong? I don't know. I haven't cheated at Doom forever. Mostly because I haven't played Doom on a PC in forever. I did play it on my Switch not that long ago. And before that, on my Xbox 360. I really like the first Doom. Doom 2, I started playing on Switch, and... I don't know, it feels like it's a little bit more cheap. It's like, alright, um, we're just gonna throw tons of spider mines at you at once. You can deal with that, right? That's, that's like a legit difficulty curve. How about, you know, three cyber demons in a row? Totally reasonable. Which is not. It, it really isn't. I mean, three hill princes in a row is enough. It doesn't need to be cyber demons. It's just crazy. Hey, this is a boss. I this guy in, like, level three or something. Ah! Please be dead. Please be dead. I have, like, level three weapon. How much life does this thing have? Is this a random encounter, or is it, like, intended to be here, on this very particular square? Because if I have to start fighting these as random encounters, I am not very excited to keep playing this game. Not that it's hard, it's just like, holy man. I don't want to spend five minutes on each encounter, personally. He's not, like, immune to this weapon or something, is he? No, that would be stupid. Could happen, but it would be stupid. change back. Whoops. See if it makes a difference. 
problem is I can only shoot one of these at a time. Much slower. I don't know. Now, I'm going back to this one. An enemy life bar would be great. Capcom, you're usually good about that. Oh my gourd, die! Just go away, I want to be done with this. I've had enough. I'm bored of this very slow, predictable enemy. How about boomerangs? Oh, the boomerangs worked, maybe. Or I just hit him enough, I don't know. Not a lot of, um, helpful feedback. Obtained four vials. Oh god, that was just a regular enemy. I think. Oh, here's something a little more palatable. That looks weird. Actually, I noticed that I have 99 vials. I probably should have spent some. But, uh, here we are. Oh no. What's in this room? Oh, this is Primeape. Do they not look like Primeape? I mean, really? I think they do. Just throw some legs on him, give him a pig nose. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh. Oh, this thing is not good either. Ooh, the circle works real well on it. Go circle. I could really use another town to spend some of these vials. I feel like they're going to waste. No, why did you start me facing the wrong way? Do you notice that one tile that's like two spaces down and three spaces to the right. It looks different from the other ones. I feel kind of compelled to go check it, but also I don't want to walk back over there and get... Can't let you meet Margarita. Breger's orders. But I want to meet Margarita. She apparently has something I need, I think. This isn't a town. Hold on. Oh, I've got two lives. Should be okay. It would be cool if these things were strong enough to break through shields. That would make me really feel like I was powered up. Just saying.
And we're going down all the way, yay. Oh, cool, look, it makes a platform, uh, thingy. That I could possibly grip onto instead of impaling myself on spikes. Oh, like that. Are you Margarita? If you want to know about the red blaze, light a candle at the altar. Uh, I was hoping it would be a talisman. That's fine, too. Upon lighting the candle of darkness, the surroundings are put under a cloak of darkness. Are you Margarita? A long time ago, the Red Blaze defeated the King of Destruction and locked him away deep underground. He was called the Red Blaze because his color was that of a blazing fire. I've been told that I'm that color. The Red Blaze, yes, he was a mutant gargoyle. Well, that's way cooler than a regular gargoyle. <laughs> there remains only one who is of the same blood. It's me. Firebrand, once you know the secret of the Red Blaze, we can't set you free. Bro, good luck. You should see how powerful my circles are. Ah, oh, with a shield. Ugh. Remember how I said it would be cool if I could... Still hit them through the shield with this weapon? Does they just turn around? What am I supposed to do? Oh, I got one. I got a hit in. One hit. Okay, one down. There we go. I'm not sure what the rules were there, but I managed to eke it out anyway. Your power is also... Now I begin to understand. The one who is of the same blood is Firebrand. It's you. Only you can defeat Breger. But you are so weak now. Go to the east and find Rushifel. Get the eternal candle from him. A lot of candles in this game. Not these spider things again. I find them annoying. Ah, uh, well, that was stupid. Designed this. I'm coming for you, Rushy Fell. I don't know if you're a good guy or a bad guy. Or a bad guy. Bad guy. Uh, Ryan, try saying a word. Uh. I did try. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Oh, go to town. Just what I needed. Firebrand, why have you come here? You fake. Rushyfell has the candle. The real red blaze is Rushyfell himself. All right, we'll see about that. It's the save room. I'll come back here in a moment. You are the Red Blaze. With your help, we can beat Brigger. Hmm, I guess we'll have to ask Mr. Rushyfell about that. Oh good, the store. Yeah. How many, uh, two talismans? I might as well just spend them all. I'm sure I'll be flush with vials again in no time. Good. Yeah, okay. Four, that seems like a good amount. Um, this is one of these towns where you have to just hang out on the edge and go around to talk to the final NPC. So another thing you see in the original Dragon Quest. Hi, friend. Remember me? It was I who gave you the armor of Guile. If you're seeking the Naga's Path, it's the fifth one from the northernmost side. The other paths are traps. Good luck, friend. Fifth from the northernmost side. I'm not sure what that means. What I am sure of is it's been about half an hour, and I feel in my heart of hearts like this is a good time to save the game. And call it for this episode. So that's it for part three of Gargoyle's Quest for Game Boy. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for watching. And I will see you on the next one. Bye-bye.